with over 50% of startups choosing to use SVB. However, they're coming under serious pressure that the bank might collapse. Two specific reasons are causing this. Faster than expected withdrawals and rising interest rates. When you deposit money at most banks, they use some of your funds to purchase securities like bonds. These banks will usually hold longer term bonds until maturity, but if you needed to withdraw money from a bank and there's not enough deposits to balance it out, they might have to start selling bonds earlier than they expected. But bond prices and interest rates have an inverse correlation. So when interest rates rise, bond prices will fall. With the Fed aggressively hiking rates, SVB is now selling bonds at a loss. To make matters worse, massive venture capital funds are urging their portfolio companies to withdraw all their money from Silicon Valley Bank. This resulted in a bank fail and the FDIC had to step in to take control of SVB. The FDIC will cover up to $250,000 worth of deposits, but they have to sell the bank's assets to make up for all the remaining uninsured amounts.